happens, we have the Back Bay Science Center. 39-year-old Joe Adams might best be described as a visionary. As president of the Discovery Science Center, he's constantly looking for new attractions that educate as well as entertain. I come from Disney, and so what Disney really taught me all about was like how do you capture both the guest experience and creating a great quality product. And so we're five minutes down the street, so we're going to be compared no matter what. And even though we're a science center, we're no profit, it doesn't matter. The guests still want great experience, and they want new product, and they want a whole the whole element of that. Adams took over as president in 2003. He said the center was keeping exhibits too long and not doing enough in terms of marketing and community outreach. The number of visitors has more than doubled under the leadership of Adams and other members of the management team. In fact, it wouldn't be surprising if attendance for the current fiscal year reaches a half million. We're a resource for the community, and so I always knew we were going to make it, but there were definitely some lean times. No longer. Yamaguchi says the center's community outreach program now includes 140,000 grade schoolers in Orange, Los Angeles, and Riverside counties. The center itself features 18,000 member families. Exhibits here change quarterly and are booked two years in advance. The success here has led to some national recognition. This month's issue of Parents Magazine has ranked the Discovery Science Center as one of the top science centers in the nation ahead of even larger facilities in places like Chicago, Detroit, and Seattle. There's all these science centers, like two, over 200 science centers in the country, and we are number 11, you know, and they did it. And so it, I, I just, my hat's off to the team, my hat's off to them to understand the community. I think it's pretty fun here, and, and I think this is my second time here. Do you wish you had one of these down in San Diego where you live? Yeah. Well, as a preschool teacher, I can tell you it's very educational. It's just a first-class experience for them to actually learn by doing and by playing. I know we had some hurdles, but we had the right team in here. I, f I feel good about it. I guess I wasn't really that surprised. It took, it took us some while, but the board and the team was there, so right. I, I feel good about it. Um, and more to come. In Santa Ana, Rick Melke, Real Orange.